Oh, when I, when I push this button, he says stuff. Watch. I hate you. <laughs> so you whisper as quietly as you can. Did you hear him? Jared. Did you? Did you? No. Let me oh, that's how I do it. Oh, damn. Let me turn my hearing aids up. Sequel to the Nightmares One, and if you remember, <laughs> as opposed to Sequel to Little Nightmares Three. Well, if you remember back in October, we played the first one, and just a quick uh, recap: we were six, which was the name of the little girl child, on a boat called the Mall, which was like a monster cruise ship. And well, now we're here. <clears throat> Where we're here is. And I don't know what you're thinking. You're thinking. But 20 below, Little Nightmares 2 is over $20. How could you play this? It's against the rules. Well, it's my channel. I'll do what I want. But realistically, there are some exceptions to the rules. We'll play some games that are over $20. It's okay. That's um, not what we were thinking. We were thinking, how were you ever a six-year-old girl? And also <laughs> here with me is my executive producer. Here for my uh, quarterly review. Make sure I don't muck it up. So anyway, Little Nightmares 2 is a suspense adventure game in which you play Mono, a young boy trapped in a world that has been distorted by an evil transmission. Together with his new friend Six, he sets out to discover the source of the transmission. Water? Um, I don't know. But it's just like the opening in the first one, but instead of a, a geisha, we're in a hallway. That's where Count Olaf lives. Do video games have subtitles? It depends on the game. So here we are. I guess this is Mono, Aww. a really ugly little boy. That's why he has a bag on his head. Stop, he's cute. And we're in a field. It was actually kind of cool because in the first game, the whole thing took place on a boat. And there's TV. Lots of TVs. Is that ashes? I think that might be leaves. Oh, I can go forward and back too. That's a new feature. Oh. I couldn't do that in the first game. First game was just left and right. So that. I think they call that 2.5D. That's not true. You could go back and forth. Well, it depends. You could go like on the back wall and stuff. Oh, you're right. You could do that. I guess I just wasn't paying attention. All right. It looks like we had to jump this gap. We right. should have replayed that before we did this. Well, it's on the channel. We played it in October. <laughs> Maybe we should have rewatched it. Can I go any faster? Is that dead? I think so. Oh yeah, and I don't know if I've uh, mentioned this, but we haven't played this camera. This is completely blind. We have no idea what we're doing. Come in the foreground. You can climb on that grass in the front. Don't go too far. You'll um, fall down that blackness, I think. I'll climb on this grass. Yeah. Okay, that's how I run. Okay, I can run. I should have known that. We only played the game in October. The controls aren't that dramatically different. I'm going forget this it's quickly. In a cage. I don't think we can grab it. Can I grab it? I can climb on top of it. <laughs> It's the perfect size to put you in it. It's the perfect size. I know in the other game we could grab things. Hmm. And here's a, another cage. I bet you can open that one. It does seem openable. It's got a handle. But, oh, there we go. And now we crouch, crouch. There we go. Why is it telling me the controls after I figure it out? <laughs> <clears throat> okay, in a cave of some sort. So I guess it turns out that oh, 
A shoe, a shoe. It looks like Searsha's shoe. It looks like a monkey. Okay, pick it up. Is that a bag of dead bodies? It appears that way. It's just like our garage. <laughs> um, a lot of shoes too. What was I talking about? Oh, but yeah. So I guess turns out the little nightmare wasn't that little because it was a big nightmare. Because it's still nightmare marathon. <laughs> are all your jokes this corny? Yes, they are. How did I run again? I guess I can't run down the log. There's no playing. I guess so. I can't really hear anything. Did you just ask me if there was sound that you can't hear? <laughs> yeah. Nice. What is that? A trap? A gate? A gate trap? I'll jump over it. I don't like it. Looks like spikes. What happens if you walk in it? I'll die. How do you know? Oh. I could have gotten caged. I wonder if it's going to prompt somebody to show up. Hmm. Good thing we didn't get caged. Let's get out of here. I think you have to push that over. Push. And probably have to pull it over. Pull, pull. Yeah, the other game, the first one had a lot of those features too. Yeah, I, I don't think between that game and this game the mechanics are dramatically different. They're just kind of built onto the story. And I added a bag boy. Can you touch the spider web? Um. So no. I keep forgetting what button's the crouch button. You know, it gets confusing going to all these different games. Each game has different controls. Is that an auto save? Oh, no. I saw an eyeball in the corner. Yeah, the eyeball's auto save. So, eyeball in the uh, corner means it's gonna get difficult. Hi. Yeah, like that. <laughs> Yes! Ooh. Take that log. You did it. Well, there's the hardest part of the game done. Now you gotta climb up there and swing mm. on that rope. Swing along that noose. I don't even know how to get up there. Go back. The way you just came? Those rocks in the background, I think you can climb. No? No. Okay, so let's assess the situation. Wait. Hold on, I'd like to take bets. In the comment section, people should say whether or not they think I'm right. I've said multiple times, I think you need to go all the way back there and climb on that log. You refuse to climb on that log. But I haven't been wrong. Fine, we'll take bets. If she's right, then, I don't know, something will happen. You know what? <laughs> Nobody even likes you. <laughs> I mean, for somebody who doesn't play video games, you gotta grab that rope. I sure get a lot of this stuff right. Da, da, da. Oh, you son of a bitch. <laughs> you went the wrong way. Yeah, hey, we wrong did it. Number. No. I think part of the hardness is the first one I played on the keyboard, this one playing on a controller, and honestly, these controls kind of suck. They're not very user friendly, in my opinion. But maybe we're just not used to it. Alright, bridge is out. You just got an eyeball. Yes, I did. Oh, well, guess we're gonna have to jump it. Ring start. Here we go. One, two, three. Hey. Jump as close as you can to the other side because there's gonna be something yeah. that will catch it. <laughs> or just die. Oh, it's sad. Aww. You hurt him. Maybe I should climb down this rope or something. He's like Leo sized. Climb down the rope. Do okay, it. Do you oh, say shit. the kids' names? Um, I don't think I've mentioned them. I think I just say the kids, maybe. Oh, okay, that works. Nice. Now we'll climb up this side. That was pretty dick. <laughs> Who made this game? They're assholes. <laughs> Let me just make this kid jump off a cliff. 
Oops, there were stairs. <laughs> Just kidding. God damn it. I hate it when I make kids jump off of cliffs. <laughs> Look more shoes. What is that? What is that meant to be? Like some kind of holocaust? Do you think that's a trap? Nope, just a pile of poop. Nice. This is, this is the trap. Oh, there you go. Should I trip it? Jump over it, maybe? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, I can't let them all. Oh, look, it's so sad. Look, the bird. Oh, I know what to do. I'll throw the shoe into the <clears throat> trap. Take that. <laughs> Screw that trap. I think you still have to set it off so that you can use the log to climb up over that thing. Oh, you're probably right. Can you edit out that part where I was wrong? Because that makes me look really bad. Sure. Take that trap. I was just talking about how I'm always right. Don't worry, there's going to be a very heavy editing going on. We can't have all the fails all the time. I'll just take up too much time. Oh, now there's going to be another lock. What is that? That's a bear trap. I do not want to step on that. There's a lot of bear traps. But no bears. Weird. Alright. Ooh. I want that stick. That's a nice stick. Yeah, baby. <laughs> stick it to him. Nailed it. <laughs> Another stick. And birdhouses? Hmm. I think they're breathing holes. Weird. Why are we in the woods anyway? Oh, you son of a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> well, what did you think all those dark leaves were? I just thought of the pile of leaves. Someone forgot to rake. Just throw it in there. You'll set them all off. And maybe throw them a little better than that. It's not throwing stick. It's a whacking stick. <laughs> I feel like there was one more that didn't go off. Don't I get you trapped. Good. Don't get trapped. Pine cones. Oh, I guess I don't want to throw them in that bin over there. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Fool me once. Keep throwing them. Take that. Aha. I, knew I bet that. right there you're gonna step on one. Oh, no, you didn't. Some more. Can't pull the wool over my eyes. Twice. You're just going right there in front of that thing that you have to. I'll jump it. Maybe. Go grab your pine cone. <laughs> wow, it's a big bear trap. <laughs> it's still fine. Um. No, I'm still fine. <laughs> But scale, because your character is always really small and everything else is really big. So, like, are we super tiny or are we in, like, giant world? Because I don't know if you remember the first one, but, like, monsters and objects <coughs> were, like, twice our size. So, like, what's the scale? Are They're we way more than twice their size. Really. Are we normal size or is everything else big size? Look at house. I think it's like Jack and the Beanstalk. So you think we're in like some monster, giant monster world? Yeah. Okay. Uh, this is where Crazy Eddie lives. Wait, like really? Or you just made that up? Oh, I just made it up. Some creepy redneck's house. I don't think you can reach the door now. You're going to have to climb the window. Oh, boy. Although the game does look a lot nicer, it's very aesthetically pleasing. Not that the first one wasn't, but this one Oops. does look nicer. You're gonna have to hide in the oven. I'm gonna hide in the stable. Okay, get in the oven. If I go in the oven, I'll get baked for sure. Oh, that didn't work. Why did you close it? It was an accident. Can I open it? I don't think I can open it. I don't think anyone's home. Nobody's home. Can you open the fridge? Oh, shit, stop. Do you have to eat? What are, what are you 
task? What's the objective? Um, to not die. Achievement unlocked. What's in the box? Food. I didn't know you had achievements. Well, all games have achievements these days. Alright, let's go into the hallway. Alright, let's check out this room, I guess. What is in here? This is the... nope, not going in the basement. Forget that. Let's see what's over here. This is the... bedroom? I guess this is the foyer. There's no bed, that's the mud room. Oh my god. I stuck it in my pocket. A quick collectible set. Pause. Wow. What a face. Aww. Now I'm Tom Sawyer. That's funny. That's pretty neat because mm, you could never see the other girl's face. Girl, I think it's a girl. I guess I really don't know because we have to go to the basement now. I think it's your base, couldn't you? Uh, vaguely. It was, co it was covered up by her hood. Into the basement. Because it, it was always a good idea. Ew. Dusty. I hear music. Uh, let's it's go down there. this way. Can you grab the knife? Oh. I'm going to grab this ball again. Well, she's learning to sew, too. <gasps> There's another kid. I don't know. I don't know. Let's yarn it. Take that. I don't think I can get in there. We'll have to find another way. Oh, it just saved again. I guess we'll go down this door. Maybe we'll find a way through. But you'll find a person. There's an X. Maybe you do have to get one of them and like hack it open. I think I can grab this X. I'm so hacking mad. <laughs> yeah. Alright. Let's do it, Huckleberry Finn. I'm not entirely convinced you're gonna get very far with that. With the X or this just in general. <laughs> Oh, I scared him. Here, Johnny. You <laughs> <laughs> oh, scared the baby. Sorry, baby. It's good it wasn't you. Bring him his music box. Oh, maybe he's just gonna like you because you're a person. Hey, I can't control it right now. Is that oh, six? Oh. He's been counting how long he's been in there on the walls. Hey, left me like. Poor kid is scared. I'm taking your music box, man. It's mine now. Hey, come back. I don't yeah, I think be, you're supposed to follow him. I don't want to be here any more than you do. This place is scary. Somebody lives here. Wait for me. Is that vomit? Don't worry about it. Just follow the kid. <laughs> Oh yeah, those are fake. Well, that's not terrifying. That's super creepy. You gotta climb that, honey. I don't wanna come too. Climb. Oh, wrong button. No wonder I wasn't climbing. I just proactively that's have really gross. my finger on the bumper. Uh -oh. The attic. You oh. gotta help him. I'll help you. Oh, wait, okay. You go and then I'll go. You're, you're a better jumper than me. Yeah, okay. I get it. Yes. I want you to come closer. I think we're on the same page. Alright, let's do it. Wait, lift me up. Alright, one, two, three. Alright, grab my legs. Yeah, teamwork. Watch out for the shoe. You might want to take this shoe with. I don't think I can carry a shoe and climb a ladder. How do you know if you don't try? Well, we 
just saved again. And some hand mannequin parts. Better than Anakin parts. Uh, 